What's up, my comic community? My name's Cullen, and I collect comics, and today's Wednesday, and tomorrow we'll be doing my last two weeks of new comic books. I'm not going to have the uh, solicitations for those, because I, uh, whenever I got my uh, CLZ, I accidentally uh, made it for, uh, basically, I made it where the... Uh, I have an extra. I had an extra month on my phone as compared to my uh, computer, so therefore I'm letting my computer one run out, so I can't do the synopsis. If that makes sense. I'm gonna let it run out till like halfway through this month, and then I'm gonna just uh, renew them both at the same time. That way, uh, you know, keep it all together. But uh, all right, well, like I said, I'm gonna do my things from another world on this video and things from another world i pick up a lot of books from them they do a lot of mail order out of the west coast and yeah let's just get right into this thing One brick, see if there's anything else. I'm guessing that they even put the, uh, oh, looks like they even put the thing in here because I don't see the, uh, don't see the cargo manifest. It's really what I wanted to call it. You know, the itemized receipt. One might. But, alright. That should be enough. Let's get her done. And yeah, I don't see the uh, itemized receivables thing at all. They must have forgotten that. Yep. All right, first time that's happened, we're just gonna have to wing this. First, we got trees beneath the trees where nobody sees. Number ones, I've been waiting to read this. I'm actually shocked at this. Is the first copy I've gotten it in there because I did order it from Comic Sense, so but they've been kind of behind, so should have that soon. Next, we have uh, Tenement by Jeff Lemire. This is number five. This is from the uh, Bone. Orchard Saga. And, uh, yeah, I've been excited about that beneath the trees. Next we have Catwoman, issue number 58. And this is a Gabriel Del Otto cover, which is, as always, Gabriel Del Otto covers are just always so gorgeous. I absolutely love them. Next, huge fan of this series, we have num issue number two of Dwellings. And this Archie book, we have uh, Fear of the Fun House, Toy Box of Terror. I picked this up because I don't always pick up uh, I don't always pick up Archie stuff, but I figured this might have some sort of uh, here's another cover, but uh, with a Chucky looking Archie. But I always figure it might have some sort of uh, Sabrina story in it, so that's why I pick it up. Next, we got issue 14 of Grimm. I just kind of picked this up in case uh, they didn't get a Grimm in. Then we have a Jim Lee and Scott Williams cover of Justice League versus Godzilla versus Kong with big old Mecha. Mecha Batman fighting there, looking awesome. Next, I can't wait to read this. I love this series. I've been reading. Each issue, I almost wish I would have picked up another run of this. Uh, this is issue number two of Kill Your Darlings. And this is the A cover right here. And then uh, we have this awesome, I think it's a Stegman cover maybe, but we have this amazing B variant on this. And like I said, I really, really, really like 
the first issue of this. It was one of my favorite reads of last month. So I'm definitely going to read this as soon as possible. Next, we're going to move on to issue number 107 of Nightwing. And this is the Gabriel Del Auto cover. I always love Gabriel Del Auto stuff. Next, we have a Red Sonia number four foil cover. And only way I can see that this is, uh, this has got to be a Sosa Mica cover because that's the only way I can see myself picking it up. Next, we have issue number four of Sirens in the City. Uh, we're going to probably pick up all these. And then, boom. Right here, we have the My Manifest thing for this. And, uh, yeah, uh, let's see, uh, that B cover of, uh, we'll go back on some things that were definitely picked up and why. This Archie cover, Sweeney Boo, that's why I picked that up. Uh, that Kill Your Darlings cover was Stegman. Uh, Delato on this, and actually, I was wrong. This is actually a Frizen cover, not Sosa Mikey. This is Jenny Frizen, uh, metallic cover. And then, like I said, we're at Siren City, fourth issue of that. Then, obviously, the final two issues we've got the A cover of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number 144 and the B cover, which of course is the Kevin Eastman variant. And those are all my pickups from Things from Another World recently. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, hit like and subscribe. I'm going to get off here and I will holler at y'all probably tomorrow with the last two weeks of pickups from the comic strip. All right. See you later. Peace.